begin to look a lot like Christmas everywhere you go so yes Christmas will eventually come um, after anticipating it everyone is doing this these days but after Christmas comes New Year's Eve and everyone wants to have the perfect outfit for this occasion so I came up with a few ideas for this event watch as I was saying this is my first outfit for this special occasion you know French people have a saying they say se mettre sur ton 31 because I grew up in France I don't, I don't know if I uh, mentioned it before and it um, by the way you you see how I'm uh, moving from one subject to another discussion uh, suddenly so this means uh, be like on your 31 uh, they refer to the 31 31st December when everyone is is the best version of themselves so probably my hair will not be like that but this is just to show the outfit and maybe the makeup so I will begin with this two-piece set uh, normally it can be worn even at the beach but hello it's golden and it's sparkling so why not wearing it for New Year's Eve I let you see it and yes they are short the, um, those pants are short but in my version of what New Year's Eve look should be like can work with these transparent heels I show you immediately you know I like this kind of it matches my manicure my pedicure is pink so uh, indeed it's transparent I know but why not be daring for the night between the years the red carpet uh, some stars we can say they exaggerate very much this uh, for example on, on in Met Gala they wear impossible outfits and looks and even Kim Kardashian she she covered her face oh my god I don't, I don't know how she survived that red carpet or what it was do you think it, wo it uh, works with a white uh, top or I think it can also work with a black one but the heels can be must be chosen accordingly so now that you've seen this outfit I love this outfit I don't know if you uh, think the same as me but um, I can go on to the next one Mwah! if you're not ready for the next video meaning if you don't consider you have to be sexy for New Year's Eve it's time you leave the video okay if you haven't left the video I'm sure you will like what I will show you next it's my second outfit and I think I will propose three so one more after this one and I let you see what do you think about this skirt it's sparkling still with my transparent heels because they can go with whatever choice you might have in head because I don't think it breaks any type of styling because uh, it's 
transparent so we cannot um, go wrong with the wrong color because the color of the skin cannot be uh, that disturbing I think so I have this piece it was from um, it was from um, yes I might propose this one with this one a third outfit I don't say more so for this occasion I chose to combine it with this glittery skirt I hope you like it it's like a serious costume but it's broken by, by the glitter in the skirt and the sexiness of the outfit I'm not tanned anymore and I shouldn't be but uh, I hope you still like my idea of what New Year's Eve should be for some women, some of us. And I have to remark, even if I have very girlish uh, content, I have a lot of boys commenting my videos. So where are you girls at? Please <laughs> tell me if you would wear this first outfit, uh, this second outfit or the first one or the next. Maybe don't comment yet. Maybe you will like the last one. If you didn't like the first outfit or if you didn't like the second one, at least I have the chance and it's very probable you will like this one because it's not, uh, it doesn't show too much skin. It's pâte d'éléphant. It's a French... Uh, model of pants you will see it right now and i said i will show you after because this was actually a costume i didn't have it in mind when i began the video but <laughs> it came afterwards uh, it has buttons right here the same buttons that are linked here i think it works well with um my hair loose or I can also have it tied up like that. Do you like it or no? Or more elaborated? What do you think? I have a pen. I was doing this in high school. High school. I don't know if it works even today. But yes, it will be like that. I don't know. But since we're here with my loose hair, I will continue like that. It was just an idea. So I will show you. So <clears throat> these are pas d'elephant. It means like uh, it's like an elephant foot. So because it's very big, the shoe isn't even supposed to be seen. You know, it's the 70s uh, famous model of pants when the revolution and all the baby boomers the baby boom came i think it's a very tidy look it's white you enter the new year in pureness in um, in a healthy way of seeing things optimistically uh, i don't i personally don't like don't really like to wear black in um on new year's eve but everyone has its reasons and its own uh, tastes you cannot discuss tastes or colors right because we are all different and uh, it's just like that so i hope you enjoyed today's video about new year's eve outfits 
I hope you will still watch my videos because there are more coming maybe in this weekend or maybe from Monday on but please comment down below it's like an encouragement for me and for what I do and welcome to the new subscribers and thank you Italian people who are watching me because I've seen they are uh, the majority of my public thank you and I wish you an amazing day as usual Mwah.